Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. <clears throat> okay. I'm just going to do a quick update. <clears throat> I hope everybody's doing good and I'll see you manana. FYI. Let's see what the energy is looking like for you guys right now. I do feel like I did the... I did the weekly zodiacs, you know, for Patreon. And what up, Buttercup? And I noticed it's going to be a little weak, uh, chaotic, chaotic week. Drink. You want to make a drink? Yeah. Fist bump. Fist bump. So I can't work again. It's broken. It is. Yes, so. it is. Yes or no? Yes. I love you. Love you. Love you. Is that your door? Yes, please. Uh, my name's Nancy Nora. I'm for dinner. Uh, turkey dinner. Okay. Thanksgiving. So, I know I probably made some of you guys drool. My mom decided out of the blue she wanted to make Thanksgiving dinner. I was like, okay. <gasps> okay. Anywho, I noticed with the 12 Zodiacs that the, um, the week was, uh, a little chaotic. So, I'm just going to get an overall poll for you guys for regarding today. <clears throat> and maybe tomorrow. <clears throat> so, we got the Prince of Swords. Communication, trying to figure out, trying to figure out something. The high priestess, maybe using their intuition, or you could be having a secret conversation. Or it's destined and faded. That's too many. That's too many. And it's my fifth. Sheldon, you're gonna get stuck. You're gonna get stuck. Okay, Prince of Swords, High Priestess, Six of Cups, Seven of Swords. Damn, damn. All right. So, but this is like stressed out. You know, being strategic. It something could definitely be hidden here. Um, the thing is with this Seven of Swords, if you look at it, he looks more exhausted. Tired of trying to figure something out. Avoiding. Um, believe it or not, I'm not getting shady. Okay. Because I was actually in the... Um, Patreon, I was getting shady. Something's definitely going down with the past, though. You guys are either conversating back and forth, it's either out in the open or it's secret, okay? Probably dealing with somebody from your past. Somebody does not know everything. Stuff is still kind of hidden, unknown. So I feel like it's possibly faded. Possibly. Got the Princess of Wands. We could be talking to her. Well, this is a, a new energy of solo on my own. Um, having like <clears throat> an adventure. You got the Hanged Man and the Queen of Cups. I do believe it's the same energy, these two women. Okay, I do believe that you're trying to look at something differently. Oh, that's a bad idea. Maybe psychically. Screw myself over. Why, what's up? I did three scoops instead of one. Oh, boy. Yeah. So why don't you just remake it? Remake it? Yeah. It's, uh, yeah, if it's gross. It is gross. <laughs> then remake it, silly goose. Can you save Sheldon? He's stuck. <laughs> look at his little legs. He can't even touch the ground. What is he doing right now? Quite the adventure, Sheldon. He's stuck. No, he's like stuck, stuck, dude. I gotta help him? Yeah. Just lift that up. No, he's, oh, he's stuck. Get to the cage, dude. Okay. <laughs> okay, don't freak out, man. What's he doing? I don't know. He's like... <sighs> All right. Did you get him? I got him. Because I'm going to make this. I'm putting him away. Okay. I love you. One. Yeah, baby. Yeah, buddy. I'm going to eat. Okay. So... There might be some energy of feeling stuck or restricted. Um, <laughs> uh, 
oh, chaos. Look at I started this feed and it's like, ah, right? Chaos. A little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Let's get one more before I tell you the story. She is changing. I think she's trying to, she just changed her thought process. I don't know what it was. Okay, so coming behind her is the Prince of Wands. So, well, it's almost like she doesn't even see this coming. See, he's strategizing. So the thing is, you both want a new beginning here. There's both something new about this energy. But I wouldn't say stuck. I think she stopped it. She changed her perspective. I think you could be dealing with somebody who's trying to take a spiritual approach when it comes to somebody from the past. Or it was a spiritual lesson. It was something, been there, done that maybe. Um, that type of energy. He is coming in. Right behind you, you just probably don't even see it coming. So there is two energies. I. You could feel, someone could feel restricted, but I don't. She's not. But it's also an offering. Somebody's definitely spiritual. Somebody could have kids with somebody from the past and they're like, oh man, what do I do? How do I handle this? Maybe the past, maybe she doesn't know about her. The thing is, you're, on the, you're actually on the same page as someone though. Not yet you're not. Mentally, it, it's like neither of you are even aware of it. Um... What is this Knight of Swords? Let's find out what this message is or what this this is for August 25th to the 26th, 2020. I think it's just somebody trying to figure something out. So Four of Pentacles. They'll hold them back. You have a masculine energy that wants to offer something new, but it's holding back. They could be given to somebody else right this second or trying to figure out how to give to you, possibly. What's this high priestess, please? Why is the high priestess here? I, I made it right this time. Awesome. Yeah. Three of Wands. So, you, so your ships are here. You're not... You're not hanging around. For nothing. It's kind of like... For this one, for this um you're either holding back from this one or the masculine and the masculine's holding back to you whatever the story is okay it's, it's definitely a big chaos guys i thought it was gonna be real quiet when i came in here um and then with the high priestess like your ships are here needing to make a decision um I think it could have something to do with reconciliation with temperance being there with a particular energy. Thank you. But you would really be mauling that over. To me, I don't know if you guys are even talking. It doesn't look like anyone's together. It looks like energies are, are, are held back. One's, you know... Because <clears throat> this is free. It's like you freed yourself. But psychically, there's something there, too. What's a Six of Cups? The King of Pence. And then you got the Two of Pence. Someone could be juggling, especially with the Three of Cups. There is a there is a special connection. But the Five of Wands, I think there's, you know, competition. Slowly moving away from what needs to be moved away from. So you do have this one energy of someone strategizing. Trying to figure something out. So you got a lot of masculine energy up top trying to figure something out. And I think the feminine is just kind of like laid back. I think this masculine definitely see wants to talk, strategizing, new idea, new conversation, wants to strike something up. I think he feels this way. Like she's making him kind of like go within. Because she's not really going within. She's not sacrificing no more. It is, she's very content. This is Princess Swans, please. Hermit. See what I'm saying? She's she's very content. 
She knows exactly what she wants. She will only fight for something if need be. She's transforming. It's kind of like Wounded Warrior. You got the death. I don't even think she's Scorp any. It's, it's transformation. And then it goes the Ace of Wands and the Fool, Ace of Cups. Whether it's the Emperor or not. You know, take it or leave it type energy. Because she's, she's just kind of like in her own element. So either he's really going, he's holding, either he's holding back from her. Because it's almost like he's holding back from her, hoping that she's on the same page. And here she is, just kind of like reserving her own energy. I mean, there's something like that going on. What's this hanging man here for? I don't think there's any delays or stalling. I think it's, you know, hoping someone's going to change the way they can see something, direct something possibly. Eight of Pence. So really going within. It's trying to conjure up something that has to do with work. This is usually something where it's a study, it's a new hobby, it's work. Someone's really trying to come up with an idea here, and it looks like the masculine energy. So I, it is kind of linked to him. See? Strategizing. But I, I think there's too many people in the picture. Right, something just doesn't feel right on the outside. So that's why I feel like you guys aren't even together. It's almost like he's hoping you're on the same page. He's strategizing. He's trying to figure it out. He could be dealing with his own family. And then you have this solo chick right here that he's looking at like this. Let's see what the Queen of Cups is up to. To me, she's just, you're taking care of yourself. You're tuning in. You're regaining your sense of something. Could be balance. Could be all sorts of stuff. What's this Queen of Cups doing? Okay. <laughs> Two of Cups. All right. So she she knows she knows something, especially with the Moon here and the Six of Cups. She's but she the world's here. Like she ended something. Feelings and all could yeah. See there could be an Empress. She's not. She's not messing around right now. Um, I don't think she's... She's not fixated on that. She's just... Yeah, it's like it's almost like she walked away. She didn't get the new stat. She could have even have felt stabbed in the back with some type of situation. He eventually is going to want to come in and have a second chance or please forgive me type thing. Um, she's certainly not sitting here dwelling on this connection I would see other cards of sorrow and frustration and boundaries and healing I'd, you know what I'm saying like so it's almost like <clears throat> it's almost like his memoirs like I, I can't even explain it it's, this is like his little journal He's holding back, feeling instructed. He's really going in. He's, I mean, he's really looking at you like fire and wanting to be on the same page. I think he might be trying to conjure up something with work. Trying to figure something out. Because he's really strategizing on how to come in and communicate whatever this idea is. He also knows that it's kind of like a match. He might have to apologize for something or he just wants to resurrect something if an apology is not needed. Seems like you're dealing with somebody who's pretty solid coming in as an earth sign. Possibly they have a family because the emperor showed her face too. That's why I feel like she's solo here. So she's actually not even here, even though you're here. This is actually what's going on with like him. So I... That wasn't even intentional. So maybe tomorrow I'll do kind of like what's going on with the woman. You know, because right now she's kind of like in her own little solitude, chilling in her own little habitat, trying to balance and ground and just keep her shit together. But she's definitely... You must have some pretty good boundaries up or something. Because <clears throat> you, you're pretty confident. You don't have to do much right now. 
It's not on you. It's on this person. Obviously, they know too that something, the ball's kind of in the court. This is Prince of Wands. <clears throat> so, women, you don't even see him coming. But he's he's a coming back around the corner. He's a coming. He wants the ten of pence with you. He wants the contentment. He wants the victory. He wants the new start. He wants to feel the passion. Okay. I will tell you, you are dealing with the King of Wands type energy. Um, even though the King of Pence is here, I, I don't see anything you know, communication coming in, you're definitely restricting this energy. They probably don't like the feeling of being restricted. They might not even see the love part. I don't see much love cards here. I think it's more like they know you guys obviously have a beautiful connection and it's mutual. Okay. Whether you're aware of that or not, chances are you are. Okay. So it's, it's going to be up to you on whether or not, I guess, you want to reconnect. Ultimately. Because this is the energy that's holding back. It doesn't look like you're involved with a third party, but it does look like there's outsiders. But I think you're very aware of that and you became the outsider and you're completely content with that too you didn't want to mess with something I don't know if you're happy with it but you were smart enough to take yourself out of whatever this was because you got this one thinking and that's what they needed to do because apparently that's what they were not doing so it looks like stuff's being done properly if you want to say it like that it looks like I don't see any negativity. This person just can't stop thinking about you, but they're they'll hold them back. I think you're getting some communication, but or they're trying to communicate. They're trying their best to hold themselves back because you went crickets on them. And now they're like, okay. Now I really need to strategize. Could there possibly be a third person? Yeah, see, it's, it's just saying it's this person again. So, yeah, see, I don't think she's she's doing much here. There's definitely two women. I don't think everyone's sleeping with each other, though. I don't think anybody's sleeping with anybody. That's why I think this is coming in. They want to get this back. Three of Wands with the High Priestess. You could be traveling. You could be going to see him. You, it could be across seas. You could be talking to somebody via, you know, email, online. Um, could have met them this way. Or, or again, you're traveling. Or, or it's your ships. You got the Death Card. So something's here is being transformed. It's going to take strength, okay, to, to communicate something. So... And if there was a third party, you put an end to it. If something was a secret, you put an end to that. This is, this is, um, this is a lot of work for somebody. Like, somebody's really putting in the work. I just, the way they're strategizing is just kind of like, eh, not the greatest. And now you got eight swords, right? So it's really mental restriction. But they are going within, again, it, it could be lack of communication, or you went silent on them. A spiritual connection could have ended. This energy is going to reach out in the next few days. It's a given. I don't think judgment's coming in quite yet. Because this one's got a lot on their mind. I 
they're trying to figure out something. They're trying to pull something together. They, they want answers to something that they, they haven't gotten yet. Yeah, with the Two of Swords. It, it's like, it's, 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 it's still me. It's, it's more you're driving yourself nuts. You go from, you know, one headache from a, to another. Like, it's, it's something like, what do I do? Yeah, something, see, something needs to end with one lover in order for something else to come in. So it's, it's actually being done. Looks like it's being done the right way. But this person doesn't want to make a decision either. They're avoiding. But the world's here, so... You know, the Five of Swords was here a lot last week, so I, I just think... It's, it's tough. The avoiding conversation, avoiding making a decision... You could have ended something vice versa. Either way, they're strategically trying to come in and try to figure this out. They want a new start. They don't want to hold back from this. So I guess tomorrow we're going to look at like where the woman's at. Whether that side of, you know, that side of the spectrum. This looks like a family man too. Slowly something is going to be put together. I, I think um, I think it's going to take a little time. In the meantime, you know, just keep, keep doing you. Keep, you know, whatever it is you're doing to maintain. I really don't know much of what you're doing and how you're maintaining if you're holding it together or not. Because right now, it literally is like, this is like the story of <clears throat> what the masculine is up to, what the masculine is thinking. And it is, it's pretty much all about, you know, all about you right now. <clears throat> I don't know if, if, you know, they think you're being a little shady because you're being quiet, but... They're exactly, I think, where they need to be if they want to try to figure out something that has to do with this connection. Something karmically is going to go in someone's direction. That's a given. Okay, so, like I said, I guess tomorrow um, I'll come back in and we'll see where the women are at, okay? I love you guys. Have a good rest of your day. Bye.